talking today to Monica Montero of CineVideo. CineVideo has an office in Mozambique and is a Brazilian company that has chosen to make its base, one of its bases there. Monica, why did you choose to open in Mozambique? Well, uh, Mozambique chose us. Uh, we were in this fair, MIPCO, about five years, six years ago, and uh, one guy from the television wants to come to talk with us, and they want to capacity people from his television. And when I come back home, I already have my ticket in my table. And I said, wow, I think it's serious that. And I went there to see the Mozambique, and I never came back. Right. Yes. Uh, the first wor uh, job that we, we made there was uh, after capacity, it was a soap opera. We made a soap opera, and by that time they didn't have a lot of actors, and so we mm. have to capacity actors, we have to capacity people to to work with the camera, work with fiction, work, you know. So in order was, to produce the soap yes, opera. Yes, yes, it was very good. Uh, we uh, bring just 25 person from Brazil, and we contract 105 person from mm. all the, 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 the soap opera. It was a very, very uh, good uh, starting, you know. Yeah. First of all, for us to understand the new culture, and after to how we can exchange culture, you know, to respect culture. And what was the soap opera called? Uh, is it, what, what is about it? Yeah. Uh, it's about health, it's about, of course, they have a lot of stores, yeah. just like it's a drama. They have, uh, it's a, about health, yeah. about education, you know, education program, about drink and drive, and uh, uh, it's, a whole a series relationship. Of it's a relationship. It's a relationship. Just yeah. like a Brazilian soap opera, you yeah. have a lot of drama. Yeah. <laughs> so after that, what did you do? Well, I mean, we start to do a, a TV programs over there about food. Uh, and now I'm learning uh, with the country now. And uh, we decide to get a, a office over there because that's the only way that I can see how the people live and uh, to to exchange culture because they have a, I have a lot of things to learn with them also. Mm. So I have to be there. So yeah. I spend 10 days of my my life every month in Mozambique to understand, to travel, to talk to the people, to, to see how's the culture. And after that, we decided to put the office. Our office have 15 person, just two Brazilian in all from Mozambique, and uh, we have a, a lot of uh, uh, work over there. One of the works a uh, TV program about food, and uh, and these TV programs are for the government channel, TVM. TVM, no, we pass in the STV, it's a, right. a, a, a private television over there. Okay. And, and we have part of money from Brazil, part of money from Mozambique. And uh, why we decide to do that? Because they have a lot of people that is, uh, they don't have nothing to eat, but they have food and they can plant, they can mm. do things. So we do the same in Brazil and we decide to do the same program in Mozambique. We are very similar in, in a lot of cultures, so mm. it's easy for us to understand what they're saying. Mm. And you're doing a program at the moment on African presidents. Yes, it's this year we did, well, uh, before that, that program we have one about women, and uh, that's very important for us because we, we show that the, all the economy have the women uh, inside, mm. all over the country. Now, I travel for 30 places already in Africa, it's 50 countries, mm. in, in 30 countries I already know. I read travel, I read talk to people, shooting over there. So uh, we, the first one, uh, the, this beginning of the year in January, we're shooting um, uh, about women, the she, the name. Mm. And it's five kind of powers. The power of money, it's a businesswoman, the Muslim. Yeah. It's uh, the power of right, an Adini, a Nobel from South Africa. Mm. Ali Ma from Liberia. Uh, Graça Machel from uh, the power of education. And the other one's the Prime Minister of, of Mozambique is Luisa Diogo and the power of a uh, to be a, a politician. Uh, so we showed that in the documentary in afternoon TV program. So every year we have two or three documentary mm. in uh, African history. Okay. Uh, but now we are doing uh, uh, African, African presidents. presidents. And why that? Because the people who want to show us bad news. And in a country have bad news but have a good news. 
Every country is like that. Mm. So that's why we want to show a program without stereotype. Mm. Uh, so how many presidents are you doing and from we which places? We are doing 14 presidents. Uh, in the, we show us because the first lady, uh, first woman, a president like Liberia, uh, a, popula a, a huge uh, country, mm. and the country that already has uh, elected their president. So we can show a new president for the, the, the world. This, this is going to be translated for English, Portuguese, Spanish, Arabian, and Swahili. So it's the first program that we have Swahili. It's mm. a language that 200,000 people, 200, people speak Swahili mm. that can see a program produced by other, other countries. Monica, thanks for talking to me today. Oh, sure.